The same thing has happened in Africa. There are cases of small children being accused of having evil in them and they are kind of just left to die, even by their own parents. Hi, what's up you guys? Today we're going to be talking about witches. Ooh. Welcome back to our Halloween special for this month. Um, today's topic is going to be about witches and we're going to be covering everything from the history to their perceptions to modern day. So let's get started. Now history are traditionally considered to be these evil, schemy, ugly women with warts on their face, with hunchbacks. They're um, perceived as being hunched over a cauldron all the, all the time or Another popular perception is of witches who used to fly around on their broomsticks, um, cackling and scaring people. So, a little background on witch on witches. Let's get into the history. Early witches were people who used to practice their witchcraft by casting magical spells and um, calling upon spirits to do their bidding. Most witches were considered to be evil women or men who cast these spells and used um, used evil magic to do the devil's work. They were considered to be pagan um, by people who practice Christianity. The earliest account of witches in history is in the Bible. It's in the book of Samuel and it is said to be written from about 931 BC to 721 BC. And it's said to tell the story of King Saul who sought the witch of Endor Endor to summon the spirit of Samuel to help him defeat the Philistine army. The witch arose Samuel who then prophesied the death of Saul and his sons. Saul ended up committing suicide. In the Old Testament, witches are also condemned. In Exodus 22:18, there is a, a verse that says, Thou shalt not suffer a witch to live. So witches are definitely seen in a bad light, especially in Christianity. Witch hysteria really took place in Europe during the mid 1400s. During this time, people who were accused of witchcraft were tortured and many of them ended up confessing to being witches. During this time, witch hunts became popular and many of the accused people ended up being executed, unfortunately. 80,000 people who were suspected of being witches were put to death between the years 1500s and 1660. 80% of those people were women who thought that who were thought to be in cahoots with the devil. Now, the Salem Witch Trials is the witch trials that occurred in Salem, Massachusetts in the year 1692. The Salem Witch Trials began when 9-year-old Elizabeth Paris and 11-year-old Abigail Williams began suffering from fits and body spasms, as well as uncontrolled screaming. Most little girls were the first two, but more young women began exhibiting similar symptoms as time went on. And due to their system, hysteria ensued within the community. And soon enough, there were three women who were accused of wit being witches and doing these things. The three women accused were Sarah Good, Sarah Osborne and Tatuba, which was uh, an enslaved woman who was owned by Paris's father. Now, after being questioned, Tatuba confessed to being a witch and began accusing other people of being witches as well. On June 10th, during that year, Bridget Bishop became the first accused woman of being a witch to be sentenced to death. She was hanged in the Salem gallows. Around 150 people ended up being accused of being witches during that time and out of those 18 women were put to death and six men were also convicted of being witches massachusetts was not the only place in the united states that um started accusing women of being witches actually the first person to be convicted of being a witch was in connecticut in 1647 alice young was the first person in america to be executed for being a witch in 1647 now, let's talk about modern day witches. Now, modern day witches are people who generally practice Wicca, which is now seen kind of like a religion. Um, now, these women are 
trying to shed the negative stereotypes that have been put onto them throughout history. Wiccans avoid evil and the appearance of evil at all times. They have a motto which says um, harm none, so that is their motto. Now modern day witches are more just people who practice um, their spirituality and their inner magic and um, just trying to connect with nature. Witches um, today still practice witchcraft, however there's nothing evil about it, there's nothing sinister about it, they're just um, practicing their magic and they usually are trying to stop people from doing evil or people from harming themselves. So it's not a negative practice at all. Um, witches use what they call the Book of Shadows. Um, that's where they get their spells from. It's kind of to, for another religion, it would be similar to kind of like having a Bible. That is um, their book where they practice um, their religion for um, witches in contemporary culture. Now, witches are often um, shown in contemporary culture. We have seen witches in older portrayals in the 90s such as the movie hocus pocus where we see these more sinister witches and they're trying to kind of take the life force from these children to regain um youth and beauty and power and then we also have um the portrayal of witches in movies like harry potter where we see that witches and wizards aren't just um just like everyday people there are some people who are evil and there's some people who are good and some witches use their magic for good some witches use the magic for evil but generally the portrayal of those wizards um and witches were of good people trying to fight evil and um protect their magic and the um the community that they live in so there's both of these portrayals from media there's also a very popular show in the 90s, it's called Charmed, and it's um, a story of three sisters who kind of come into their magic when they're older, and it's about them learning how to be witches and learning how to practice their craft, and in that show you also get to see um, kind of like um, the Hollywood, I guess, portrayal of a book of shadows and how they use it. So yeah guys, do you guys believe in witches? Do you think they're real? Are you a witch? Let me know in the comments down below. Um, let me know if you like this video and if you want more things like this. And if um, if you guys have anything you would like to suggest, any spooky videos or any um, Halloween themed videos of any kind, let me know in the comments down below. I'll make sure to check them out. And um, I probably, if you guys suggest anything, any video you want to see, I probably will do the research for it. And I would love to do a video about it. So let me know in the comments down below. And yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Remember, I post videos every Tuesday, Wednesdays, and Fridays. So, see you guys.